The key to a healthy diet is variety. There are seven main nutrients that your body needs. Carbohydrates, protein, fat, water, fiber, vitamins, and minerals. You need a balance of all of these. Then you can be healthy and fit for anything. And these young footballers are putting that theory into practice. They're skillful enough to be on a training scholarship at Liverpool Football Club's academy. The club boasts an impressive track record. Michael Owen, Jamie Carragher and Robbie Fowler have all come through the youth ranks at Liverpool. For those who succeed in making the grade as a professional footballer, the rewards could be massive. But it isn't an easy ride. What do the young players need to make it to the top? To actually make it to the top level, they have to look at the whole lifestyle and what they're actually doing. They can't do no things like teenagers, like with the mixing with their friends and going out all the time. Because at the end of the day, it's big, it's football. And diet, to say, is very important. Five days a week, they actually have their meals here. First-rate training facilities and coaching expertise help improve their football technique. But they don't just learn about football. Mornings are spent in the classroom taking normal lessons. Meanwhile, Di the cook is busy following Julian's guidelines and preparing lunch. My job is to feed the boys and to follow the menu that Julian has made out for the week. They have different things each day of the week. Mostly pasta, chicken, rice, salad, jacket potatoes. They can't have any chips. In fact, we have a deep fat fryer in the kitchen and it's never used. A balanced diet is important for the footballers to give them sufficient energy requirements um, and to give them sufficient protein to allow their normal growth and also the extra muscular development that we will be looking for. And the right but small amount of fats to give them essential fatty acids and the fat soluble vitamins. Apart from those main elements they need uh, of course adequate fluid replacement. Um, we use a lot of water and isotonic fluids for them to maintain their water balance. Not all of these boys will become professional footballers or sportsmen, but we hopefully give them a good basis for which to carry on their normal life and uh, the same principles apply to any individual.